this video, we're going on a two hundred and fifty thousand dollar vacation. Ooh. I don't even. This is beautiful. How is this real? <laughs> Let's face that quality. Oh, PewDiePie. Okay. And I'm going to show you the difference between this and a one hundred thousand dollar presidential vacation. Right this way, sir. A fifty thousand dollar vacation where we have the Eiffel Tower completely to ourselves. I'm holding on for dear life. All the way down to this one dollar vacation. Right over here, boys. This shack hey, on. is our vacation. Because this one dollar one out the rip. It doesn't look like. It looks like you can make use of it. it See inside of like it. There's no there. walls, Jimmy. Well. I mean, there's walls. This is gross. And in case okay, you don't believe me, it's a dollar. Look at that. What? Oh, it's 93 cents. You're wow. a liar. I rounded up to a dollar. For one dollar, we get this bed, which is honestly just a mattress sitting on wood planks, a broken cabinet, a light that sort of works. Oh, look but at what's that. Around it. And lastly, Depending random on what's around noises it, coming from your it may not be I was hearing bad. noise in the room, and there's a raccoon on our roof. I feel like most people oh. would be mad if their hotel room had a raccoon, but for some reason, we're happy. Oh. When's checkout time? Tomorrow. Raccoon, Keep in mind that later in this video, we're going on a hundred thousand dollar vacation, a two hundred fifty thousand dollar vacation. Can we just jump cut to that already? No, because we gotta suffer so they can compare our suffering to our happiness. They do like when we suffer. Are we all supposed to fit on the single bed? If we wanted four beds, that'd be four dollars. First, let's get all the sand. Wait. <laughs> oh, <no>! <laughs> <laughs> Who just ran in here? I'm gonna act like I didn't scream like a, a little girl. <laughs> Up next, a vacation that's ten thousand times. For some reason, that whole like house and tiny room was just reminding me of Minecraft for some reason. I don't know why. More expensive. Welcome to the ten thousand dollar night vacation. Whoa! Oh my gosh! That was Yo, a this good is jump. sick. Wait, what the heck they is just this? They should have done a hundred. <laughs> this hotel room has jellyfish. Okay, that's so unnecessary. That's oh, there's a pool outside. It's a private pool. Does this not look like a scene from a movie? Your hotel room walks out to the beach. No, that's wow. Tough. Is this our own private beach? Oh my gosh. gosh. This is incredible. Drake, since when is water this blue? I don't know. This all-inclusive hey, vacation the also water has a giant spa. Oh yeah. The a avatar park avatar filled with flamingos. Oh, they're fighting. <laughs> Flamingos. And unlimited room service. Okay, what do you need? All of it. <laughs> the only negative of this place is it doesn't have a raccoon. Hey, little guy. But I don't blame them for that. Yeah, when you spend $10,000 at this resort, we each get our own floor of the building. It looks exactly like Jimmy's, except for I got the top floor. Oh, I have a hammock. I think I can make it in the hammock without getting wet. <laughs> I did it. Yo, look at your view. Chris, hey. Oh, I caught it. Three, two, one. Hey! All right, let me lay out some rules. Rule number one. Yeah. No more throwing pillows in my pool. I Rule number two. Sorry, Tariq. And now what the hotel is known for. This insane infinity pool that extends Ooh. over our own personal beach. How does the water just not overflow? I have so many questions. I feel like a father that took his kids on vacation and is just watching them hang out in the pool. Ah! Ah! The $10,000 vacation has been insane, but not as insane as our next vacation all the way across the planet. And now that the $50,000 vacation in Paris. Yes. Baguettes. Our $50,000 vacation starts with a completely private luxury ferry ride. What is that? That's the engine. Bro, what is this, 1805? Tariq, 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 zoom in on that guy. He's filming us. Hey! <laughs> they went back. Do you have a YouTube channel? <laughs> I, I don't think he speaks English. This vacation comes complete with fantastic food, a tour of the Frog entire legs. city, All right. and a luxury hotel room with an amazing view. This is kind of romantic, huh? Yeah. You and Chandler should kiss. And lastly, we have Same a enough. very expensive surprise. So you guys are probably wondering. It's a fifty thousand dollar vacation, and we clearly haven't spent fifty grand yet. No. Yeah, where where is it? It's behind you. What do you That's mean? the Eiffel Tower. Yes. We have the entire Eiffel Tower completely to ourselves. Wait, actually? Yeah. What portion of the fifty grand was the tower? Almost all of it. <laughs> <laughs> we are at the Eiffel Tower. This feels like we're sneaking in. No, I'm not joking. It's ours. No one else is here. We can just go straight through the line. This feels illegal. Most of the time, this place is packed with people. And because we have the whole thing completely to ourselves, we're yeah. going to try to get to the top of the tower. Hey, they should do a hide and seek. Boy, a hide and seek would be tough. I'm talking the very top. Boys, enough playing around. Let's head up. On the way up, we stopped at the first floor, over 187 feet in the air, where we had a world-class restaurant all to ourselves. I love how even though we have the entire Eiffel Tower, they still put us in a corner of the restaurant. 
That's the elevator coming from the top of the Eiffel Tower. That looks terrifying. Open sesame. That reminds me of Russia. Thank you. I can see my house from up here. We're in France. <laughs> I can see my hotel from up here. Look how high up we are. Oh, my ears are popping. What are we working with here? Oh my God. You can see the whole city from here. Dude, this is crazy. Tree. Look how much higher we have to go. Bro, this is never gonna end. I'm not gonna lie, I thought we were already at the top. <laughs> we're going up. Now we're heading to the top. At one point, this was the tallest building in the world. Should I jump right now? No, do not move. Come on, boys, follow me. Jumping From here on crazy. out, there's no more elevators, just stairs. Oh, it's windy up here. We are high up there. Oh, oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, Drake, don't drop the camera. We are standing over 900 feet in the air. The highest point civilians are allowed on the tower. But since it's ours for the night, I had one last surprise. What do you think's behind this door? Stairs. Another elevator. Actually, did I, how'd you know? We can uh, see the stairs. Well, yes, there are more stairs, but this takes us to the very top where no one's allowed to go. Oh my God. Oh my gosh. Bro. Oh my God. Are we allowed on that? I don't know. Oh, 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 that is scary. The ledge just comes up to my waist up here. I'm holding on for dear life. I completely understand why tourists are not allowed up here. We have a cameraman on the other side of the city with a lens zoomed in on us. He's over a mile away. If this lens is good enough, you should be able to see Ain't us no waving. Way, for a $50,000 vacation, you gotta admit this is Still cool. This is amazing. This is a once in a lifetime it's experience. Cool. Are you ready for the best moment yet? I don't know why a YouTuber has this much power, but lights! Oh, there we go. Oh my god! It's like a disco oh, show! Holy cow! Guys, I don't know if this next command's gonna work, but turn every light off! Oh. It's pitch black! Oh. The Eiffel Tower went dark! What are these millions of French people thinking right now? They should get me off this tower. I don't know why they gave me this much control. Next, we head to Switzerland for the $100,000 vacation. I, hey. But this right is- Right now, I got uh, 10, 000, the one that's 10,000. That one's definitely the No best ordinary one. vacation. Had, this hotel has oh, two inch thick yeah, bulletproof windows, a panic button that will lock down the entire office? building and is riddled with security. Because this is a hotel where world leaders and presidents take their vacation. And also, uh, the side men were in town, so I decided to invite him as well. Oh uh, my God. It smells like food in here. We've got the whole ocean in there. What? This is nuts. This wow. is the most expensive penthouse suite in all of Europe. It covers the whole eighth floor and has dozens of rooms, tons of staff waiting on you all all day and night, and absolutely crazy food everywhere. Want a hit? Yeah, get a hit of that. Oh, oh yeah. How do these guys compare to your normal Isn't that guests? From the side yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So you'd say they're pretty dumb compared to them. <laughs> <laughs> and like I said before, some of the most powerful world leaders choose this place for their Sad vacation. Even Bill Clinton, right? Clinton stayed here, and he wasn't assassinated. It's pretty safe. In terms of security <laughs> here, you have the bulletproof windows. Even this? This is bulletproof? Oh, my. It feels thick. Oh, really solid. I hope. I'm yeah. a president. Yeah, also some snipers that we can put on the rooftop. You have your own With sniper? Fist. <laughs> <laughs> Are you able to negotiate on behalf of the sidemen? I can try my best. Yes, uh, this will help me in my negotiation. I'd like to buy 10%. How much, boys? No, you, the guy, you say. 200 million, Jimmy. 200 million. All right, to the panic button. <laughs> Oh, no. I'm not gonna lie, I've been waiting to press this button since we got here. We all agree this is a good idea. No, no, no. no. <laughs> Carl, you're Bill Clinton and you feel threatened. Press the panic button. All right, he pressed it. Oh, wait, I see a door closed. Wait, are we locked in? Is it locked? Are you guys in there? Is that Nolan? Yeah. The door is like shut. I walked off for one second. Which button uh, opens it? You don't get to panic and then open it. <laughs> I was about to say. They should push the button now, the police will come, and there's a big fine. Don't press it again. <laughs> <laughs> I've been thinking, how would a president get somewhere like McDonald's? Let's see how presidents travel. Come on in. It turns out when you're well, the president, you have to go everywhere with your bodyguards, so that means when you drive. Oh, we got like a Oh, we got an entourage. Okay. <laughs> How do we know which car to get into? And the third and the fourth? Ideally the third or fourth, you said? Which car is the most dangerous? The first one. Nolan, you should ride in the first one. I can do that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Who wants to ride with me? Harry, come on in. Harry Chandler. I'm sure the president doesn't sit in the middle. Typically, you guys would be my bodyguards, but, you know, you'll suffice. Just squeeze in, mate. Squeeze in. What president is going to McDonald's? Does your window roll down? Hey, how's it going? Oh, now we're going to get shot. Oh, now we're going to no. get shot. Oh. Oh.
can't believe we can do this. This is nuts. Turns right. out when you travel in a presidential motorcade, a lot of people start to notice you. How's it going? <laughs> this is punk as well. I thought we are just drawing the attention of everyone. People are filming like we're the president. This is weird. Which made McDonald's a little awkward. Excuse us. <laughs> <laughs> Don't mind our security. Jimmy, does this beat out the Eiffel Tower for you? Depends how good these nuggets are. Obviously, all the vacations so far have been amazing, but they pale in comparison to this next one. Hey, Our maybe final vacation is once again the all the way across. The, the president's be having the bodyguards looking clean, bruh. The what the hell? Oh, boy, I thought I just got bombed. And now we're in Japan for the $250,000 vacation. And we're meeting up with a special guest here, so you're gonna want to watch to the end. To start off our vacation, we dropped off our bags at the most expensive hotel in all of Japan. This yeah, is gigantic. Tough. I have an echo in a hotel room. And afterwards, we felt like getting to know the city of Tokyo. Now we're gonna drive Tokyo. Mario Karts on the street. <laughs> we rented private Mario Karts where we literally get to drive on the streets of Japan. People are just staring at us. This is not meant to be on a street. There's real cars driving right beside me. Well, look how many people are crossing the street here. This is the busiest crossroad in the New world, York. and we're driving right through it. Literally oh, we're on go karts in Tokyo. Bro, I love Japan. This place is crazy. When we arrived at our next destination, we met with Master Swordman Yoshio hey, that boy He's been training with the katana for the last 26 years. And he actually agreed Tanjiro. to give us a rare lesson in the art of the samurai. We each got our own katanas, and the Ooh. lessons began with swinging techniques. That red one? Boy, that shit was clean. Where is part it? of the samurai. We each got our own katanas. That one right there. Yeah. And the lessons That's began tough. with swinging techniques. It was not as easy as we thought. So. No! No, no, they're gonna zoom in on it. Then it was my turn. Boys, you think I'm gonna be able to do oh, this? Mr. Beast. Yes. Yeah, you got it. Hey. hey! Let's see how the boys do. Whoa. Yo, what's up? Gotta get that precision. I? And then, our samurai teacher gifted us this insane katana. I don't deserve this, but thank you. And because this is a quarter million dollar vacation, we rented out the most premium sushi chef in the world, along with this entire floating restaurant. They got Louis Vuitton coasters. Oh the chef makes no, all the food uh, right next coasters. to our table. And getting to see a master at work was one of the coolest dining experiences ever. Woo! What was that? Master at work was one of the coolest dining experiences ever. The heck? Woo! Mm. Wow. Oh my god. Oh. They said we could do the bread too. Here you go, little man. What? See how we caught him in air? And once we paid the bill, thank you. <laughs> we were off to the craziest place I've ever been. All right, follow me. I rented this whole place. But before we see it, socks off. This is basically an art museum, but for experience. Whoa. Whoa. Oh my god. I have goosebumps. My eyes are having a hard time processing it. You think this is what it looks like when you Reminds die? me of Elsa's Probably. house. What is this oh next row? <gasps> Normally, this place is completely full of other people, but we secured the place entirely for ourselves. This might be one of the best Bro. things we've ever done. Imagine being high and you go here. Dude. Dude, are these fish? That's We're oh in gosh. a pool in a museum playing with animated fish. This is the most unique thing you could ever do on a vacation. Right. Wait, the it's fish are surrounding us. Look. How did they know to surround us? They love us. They're going everywhere now. Now you're all probably hungry, which is why we're at this restaurant that is oh. ran by robots. What? Wait. My name is Pepper. Can we have a seat, Pepper? Sure. Let's find a comfortable spot. We reserved the oh, entire place, so hand. the only other people here were the robot waiters. Food robots here. Wait, so the food is delivered on a robot? An oddly fluffy robot. Pepper's staring really hard at Chan Pepper does not like Chandler. Bro, I did nothing to you. Everyone, make sure you eat tons of food, because tomorrow I rented an entire theme park and PewDiePie is going to be there. Which is really crazy. You see, PewDiePie and I have a long history. Mr. Beast, I was wondering when you would show up. <laughs> we helped him in his subscriber race against T-Series. Grab your phone, go on YouTube, search PewDiePie, and subscribe to him. Eventually, we even caught up to him. Mr. Beast is wild, has taken huh? over me in subscribers. I guess I'm getting a taste of my own medicine. That's all right, he definitely deserves it. And even though we've been friends for a while, We've never actually met in person. And because this is such a long way to meet up, I rented this entire amusement park. This is Fuji Q Highland, the park with the scariest rides in all of Japan. A 
It usually has thousands of people waiting in line. But as per usual, I rented the entire th It usually has thousands of people waiting in line. But as per usual. Is that Sasuke? Yo. I rented the entire thing. Okay. Gamma, gamma. Just for us. You can ride whatever ride you want. Yeah. I wasn't done, but he left. I'm about to go on this entire roller coaster alone. What you're seeing here is the steepest roller coaster drop in the world. Are you scared? Yes! Have fun! Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> oh I'm scared for him. Woo! <laughs> and like promised, the father of Gamakichi, that's his name. That's his name. YouTube PewDiePie met us in the park. A little later than planned because I texted him the wrong day. Sorry, Felix. Dang. And he wanted to ride the craziest coaster at the park. Why are you scared? I'm so scared of roller coasters. This one, this one doesn't spin at all. I'll ride it if Felix rides it. Let's go! I'm terrified. <laughs> I'll do it. I'll do it. If I die on this roller coaster, you guys are going to feel terrible. You take your shoes off? Anything that could fly out. That's how you know it's a bad. They don't even trust us with shoes on this ride. You got this. You'll be fine. I did not. This was my worst nightmare. I'm scared. I'm scared. I don't want to do this. You're scaring me. Calm down. <laughs> oh. Whatever you do, don't throw up. I'm terrified. Can we pick a better one? We could have picked a nice, comfortable ride. I actually have no idea what it is. At some point, I there wish... is a literal 90 degree drop. You're freaking me out. <laughs> what did you sign me up for? You brought me here. Yo, that looks so fun, bro. But what we didn't know was... Wait, no! You're going backwards? This ride goes backwards. Why are we going backwards? <laughs> Oh, 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 why did I do this? Oh my god, we're upside down! Damn it! Nah, that looks so fun, bruh. This is crazy! Best roller coaster ever! Oh my gosh, Felix, what did we just do? I'm crying. Best roller coaster ever. If I got tears just running down. Let's get mini you, Jamie. I'm gonna yeah. get out. <laughs> Imagine, yeah. bruh. We screamed at the first little bump. <laughs> What? Wow, that was fun, bro. Thank you. I don't think I've ever <laughs> had a chewy it's potato six. before. <sighs> That's okay. what you get for passing me. What you <laughs> uh, Felix, I'm sorry for passing you. You don't have to threaten me with violence, though. So. They're good. Yeah, they are good. That was the $250,000 vacation. Felix, can you transition us? Bro face. Oh, t -shirt. What's this tea cereal? What the fuck? Oh, that was a beautiful video, man.